Hello everyone and welcome back to another weekly vlog. Today is Monday, August 23rd and I'm starting a brand new vlog for you guys. I honestly don't even know where to start with this week because if you saw last week, you know um, at the end I had a million like pieces of inventory that I needed to work on. And if you can even believe it, I actually got more inventory delivered. I ordered Jomar boxes like over a month ago two cpr boxes and now <laughs> here we are and i have even more inventory so on top of all the stuff i showed you last week add two 40p cpr boxes to the mix and then that's where i'm at so um i don't want to make this intro like too long because i have so many things to do this week i am just my head is just spinning with everything i have to do do i have a pimple on my forehead Oh my gosh there's a pimple forming oh anyways i don't want to make this too long um i would like to go over my to-do list real quick with you guys it's pretty short as of now but the tasks on the list are going to take a while so i still want to work on the damage and stained items that's been on the to-do list for weeks um i gotta photograph all that flip stuff there the pile of jeans that you saw in last week's video the box of shoes hello balto um, I also have to process the new, quit breathing on them. I also have to process the new flip lots that are out there. I have a shoe one and then another clothing one. I showed you both of those in last week's vlog. I also have to process the Jomar boxes, which you haven't seen yet. I think I'm going to film a haul, a Jomar CPR box haul to both of them in one and just go fast. I will have to film the What's a Wednesday video and then if I decide I want to do the Jomar haul for Friday's video, I will have to film that as well. If I don't do that, I'm probably going to do the How to Find Stock Photos Part 2 um, because I've been like trying to plan that. So look at this, believe it or not. So here's my planner, okay? And I try to write down my Friday videos and then something changes and something doesn't get delivered or I have a request that I really like and then it changes. So I need to stop writing my videos down. So I've been trying to film um, or trying to plan in the how to find stock photos part two video, but it just hasn't worked. So Friday, which you guys would have already seen what happened. So what did I pick? I don't know, um, but whatever I do pick will be Friday's video, but I'll figure that out. But that is pretty much what's on my to-do list this week. I know I have like a million other things to do, but I don't even like, I can't even process in my mind right now, so I just need to, like, get started on my day. But, I know last week I wasn't very, wow, I'm talking so much in this little intro. I'm trying to make it fast, but also I have so many things to say. Last week I, um, as you guys know, if you saw last week, um, I was feeling kind of unmotivated and not really wanting to do much. I think that had to do with, um, me burning myself out the previous week. Also, it had to do with just the weather being gloomy. I'm the kind of person, the weather affects my mood. If it's gloomy, I'm gloomy. If it's sunny, like now, I'm sunny. So this week I'm feeling very motivated, really excited, um, ready to get to work. It is 9.30, if I didn't say that already. Um, I've been up for a couple hours. I woke up at like, I don't know, my boyfriend left. Oh, that's what I didn't tell you guys either. My boyfriend got the new job. I don't think I ever told you guys that. So he started his brand new job today. We're so excited. Um, he left for that this morning at seven o'clock this morning which is very different than what he's used to. He um, usually would be working nights. So he's very excited. Um, I need to check up uh, with him um, in a little bit. Um, I hope he's having a great day. But I got woken up when he left um, at seven. So I just stayed up. Like I tried to go back to sleep, but it wasn't happening because I was like, for one, very excited for him. And for two, I couldn't stop thinking about all the things I had to do. So I just got up at seven and for some reason I'm very awake. Um, but uh, basically, what I'm trying to tell you guys is I'm very motivated, very excited. My boyfriend started a brand new job today. We're both very excited. And if you guys watch like my older vlogs, like when I first started filming videos, which they're not that great, like they're way better now. Well, uh, uh, kind of. But if you were watching like my first vlogs, you would know I used to work out every day, Monday through Friday. And I stopped because of my wrist. And as you guys know, I still don't know what's wrong with my wrist. Never went to the doctor. Still hurts. That's great. Um, everyone I know thinks it's like carpal tunnel, which it's possible. Um, but my wrist still hurts. But I want to get back into working out. So I think I'm going to wear my wrist brace to work out. So I think today I'm going to jump on the um, cycling bike. We have a bike in our living room. I don't know if I've ever told you guys that. 
we have a cycling bike it's like a peloton but a cheaper version which is great for me um and i'm gonna jump on that and do just a ride i don't know i'll probably just do like a ride through something ride um just to like ease back into it because that stuff is difficult and then i'm gonna do probably i think an ab video um because that's kind of like my problem area in my opinion like i don't really have a problem with anything else except for my stomach and my arms are bothering me a little bit like the flabbiness on my whatever you guys do not care about my insecurities but i'm gonna jump on the bike i don't know where this like workout motivation came from i'm the kind of person that's not ever super motivated to work out and i was for a long time until my wrist started hurting and it I mean, now hopefully it doesn't bother me too much, but moral of the story, I'm just trying to tell you guys I'm going to do a workout today and hopefully I can stick with it. Um, I'm going to try to do a workout Monday through Friday. Um, and yeah, that is pretty much it. I'm going to go. I said that this wasn't going to be a long intro. It's a very long intro. Right now I'm going to finish the vlog. Uh, it's processing now. Um, and then I need to upload it. I need to make the thumbnail and then I will probably do my workout next and then we will start the day. So I will come back to you guys later when I have an update or I'm doing something else that I want to show you guys, but I'm very excited for the week, very motivated and I'm ready. So let's get started. All right, guys, it is Tuesday, August 24th. It is about 930 in the morning and I just finished filming the What's So Wednesday video. This is the earliest I've ever filmed a What's So Wednesday video and you know why? It's because my boyfriend is at work and usually he wouldn't go to work till later so I didn't have the house to myself and I couldn't film in peace and now I can film in peace. Like I love him and all but like I need some peace and quiet sometimes. Um, he had his first day at his brand new job yesterday. He is loving it. He is very excited. He left again this morning not as early but he is on day two so I'm very excited for him. And I'm just, I don't know, I feel like our, we're starting a new season in life. So um, I'm just excited. Yesterday, I didn't film a ton. I filmed a little bit, but I did photograph the entire rack of stuff. All I didn't, all I didn't photograph was the box of shoes. I don't know if I showed you guys. I showed you guys in last week's vlog, but not this week. I do have the two flip flops in the living room. One is all shoes. One's all, I think it's maybe shoes and clothes. I don't know what's in it yet. I'm going to kind of run over just a plan for my day. I'm going to do a lot of listing today um, of all the stuff I photographed yesterday. I'm going to get the, at least one flip flop process, the shoes process first. Then I'm going to photograph that shoe box I already have in here. And then the shoes from that flip lot. And then, um, probably photograph all the shoes. I think I already said that. Um, and then I will work on listing. And then tonight, I'll probably process that other flip lot so it's ready for tomorrow. And then I have three flip lots I need to relist today, all for my regular consignment client. Two got extended past the 90 days, and one of them is at 45 days. So, um, that's what I'm looking at for the day. I will, I'm going to actually do another workout today, but. I've, you guys have been here for a little bit. You know about my wrist. Explained that to you yesterday. Um, I went on the cycling bike yesterday and I wore my wrist brace. And it helped a little bit, but my wrist really hurts this like really bad this morning. Um, and so I think I'm actually going to go swim in the pool. Like I'm going to swim laps or like back and forth as my workout today. Also because if I do the same thing over and over again, I'm going to get bored. So um, once it gets a little hotter outside um, and the pool water is a little warmer, I'm going to go swim um, like back and forth for a little bit or just like swim. I don't know. I'm going to do something in there to do a workout um, just to like get moving. But I rambled enough. I'm going to go ahead and get to work. Um, hopefully, actually, I don't know what I have to show you this week. I'm trying to get as much as I can done. So then if there's a sale at the thrift store, maybe I can go. Um, even though I have so much inventory. It's like I have so much. It's bad. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and process these flip lots and then um, maybe knock out some listings or photograph the shoes. And then I'm going to go swimming, eat lunch, and then I'll probably come back and give you guys an update later. You guys, look at this. It says she shed and you know where i'm gonna put it i'm gonna put it on the outside of my office because my boyfriend has one that says man cave and now i have one that says she shed this was like seven bucks at hobby lobby it was half off and i just got back from hobby lobby actually um my sister texted me earlier and asked if i wanted to go with her so i went with her um this morning i what did i do um what did i even do this morning package some orders put this on the porch. I started processing all the flip stuff. I have a few more items left in a box. Um, 
and then I did a workout in the pool. I just swam laps and did some like other things. Um, and then I did like a shower, a body shower, did not wash my hair. And then I ate lunch and then my sister picked me up and now it's 4.15 and I haven't done too much work today, but I have done a little bit. Um, but right now I'm gonna hang this sign up and then I'm gonna finish processing that last box um, and then going to list some stuff um relist some stuff um and then if i have time later i will start photographing these shoes if i don't that'll be the first thing i do tomorrow but i'm probably going to focus listing for the rest of today and then relisting the stuff i need to relist um but yeah that's kind of how the day is gone but um like i said it's 4 15 so i'm gonna go ahead and hang this up and then process that box and then get to listing <laughs> So here's my boyfriend office where it says man cave on the top and this is his office and then you go to my office and now it says she shed <laughs> i love this Thursday right now it is about 11 30 in the morning um I showered this morning and I took a million photographs of shoes um I don't even know what even I told you guys last I don't know when I filmed last either I know I didn't film anything Wednesday and I think I may have filmed something Tuesday but I don't remember um but my boyfriend has been um sick the last couple of days he as you guys know he started his new job on monday um and then he actually was getting sick tuesday night after he got home from work he wasn't feeling good at all um and then wednesday or well i guess it was more of like wednesday at like one o'clock in the morning two o'clock in the morning he was feeling really really bad he was having um, extreme like body aches and body chills and just like everything, um, a, quite a bit of COVID symptoms. Um, and then when we went into Wednesday during the day, he didn't go to work. Um, he just contacted his work, told him what was going on. And then um, Wednesday, he wasn't feeling as bad um, during the day as he was at like two o'clock in the morning. Um, and then now we're on Thursday and he's feeling um, not really any better or any worse, kind of just the same. Um, but he has now lost taste and smell. So um, thinking it's COVID, he has a COVID test scheduled today at three o'clock. Um, so he'll go to that in a few hours. Um, I've had COVID before he, um, I don't, has he had COVID? I don't remember. Um, but he's now lost taste and smell. So most likely he has COVID. And so I will not be going anywhere for a couple weeks. I'm feeling fine so far. I'm a little tired. Um, and I've had COVID before, so I know how it feels and it doesn't feel like I have it. Um, so I, I think I'm fine. I'm not really taking any precautions to like prevent it. Cause if I'm going to get it, I'm going to get it because I live I mean, we live together, um, and we sleep in the same bed. So if I'm going to get it, I'm going to get it, but he is feeling okay. Not terrible, not great. Um, kind of just in the middle and he's kind of like staying steady, not getting better and not getting worse. Um, he did have a fever the Wednesday at two o'clock in the morning and went up to about a 101, almost 102. Um, so it hasn't gotten too bad. He has no fever right now. He had a fever for, um, maybe eight hours. Um, and then it finally broke after I gave him some more medicine. But I've been getting work done still. Yesterday, I 
listed um, almost everything I had in my camera roll. I had so much stuff to list. I'm um, gonna list it almost all of it. So today I'll get the rest of that listed. Um, and then I did photograph just a little bit ago um, shoes. So I photographed an entire overflowing box of shoes. Took me, I actually don't know how long it took me. I need to start timing myself for these things to see how long it takes me to do stuff. Um, but now I have all that to list as well. So the rest of the day I will be working on listing some more stuff just like I was yesterday. Um, I made a bunch of sales yesterday and I packaged those this morning. I think I did film a clip of that. Um, and I put that in the video. Um, so sales this week have been really good, even though I haven't been, um, doing much in my office. I've been doing a bunch of work, like in the bed and on the couch. Um, I have that rack of clothes I need to measure and photograph. And then a small little stack of pants over here that I need to measure and photograph. Um, but that's nothing crazy. I have two flip flops that were shipped yesterday. One of them is all shoes. And then one of them is from my regular client. Um, and then, yeah, I'm pretty caught up. The only thing I have is the two Jomar CPR boxes. I have, today's Thursday, so tomorrow's Friday, which means I need to have a Friday video. And I don't know if I will have a Friday video because I'm, I mean, I don't know if I will have time to film it. Um, I also don't know if I'm really up for filming it. I really do not want to miss an upload day, but I just feel like I need to be not so hard on myself and if you if you can't get it out you can't get it out i mean you guys are not gonna like be mad if i don't get a friday video out so i should be not so hard on myself but um that is kind of just an update for the last couple days i don't know what i really like said last to you guys but that is kind of what's going on i'm gonna go check on him right now make sure he's not running a fever like i said his covid test is at three o'clock so right now it's almost it's like 11 30 ish so, um, I will, I'm probably going to make lunch here in about an hour, um, and he'll, I'll see if he wants to eat something, but that is kind of it. I will update you guys once we get his results. It is going to be a rapid COVID test, so we should, we should get the results today. Um, so I will keep you guys updated and hopefully film some more for you guys, but probably won't be anything super interesting. So yeah, that's where we're at. So um we'll see how the day goes i'll see what i get done and i will come back later and update you guys for the covid test all right this is a very strange angle but we are at some covid testing place it's like 3 17. we've been sitting here for a little bit he just went in to actually get his test um and i'm just waiting for him out here i drove him because he didn't i mean he's sick very sick so he didn't really feel like driving um but he's in there now and i guess i will tell you guys the results when we get him back i am feeling a little worse than earlier my throat hurts just a little bit and i'm like really tired um and my head hurts really bad um but it could just be because i haven't drank enough water today and whatever um so i'm feeling like okay just like tired and throat hurts and that's it um i'm fine i don't really feel sick at all so i don't know if he has covid i probably will get it too um we're really hoping it's negative there's a chance it's negative he um his taste and smell is like he can taste earlier he could taste like a little bit he was eating some cheetos and he could taste them a little bit but then it would like go away and he couldn't taste anything so I don't really know his like taste and smell thing is all weird it like kind of goes in and out um so we're not really sure if it's COVID or not but the safest thing to do is come get a test so we're here and I'm waiting for him to come back out I don't know how long this is gonna take I also decided I'm not gonna upload a Friday video tomorrow this will be my first upload I've ever missed because I upload Monday Wednesday Friday this will be the first one I ever miss which will be very sad for me but I need to just let myself have like one day of not posting like it's not gonna kill me um because i'm just tired and trying to take care of him and just everything um so yeah we had to drive 30 minutes to even get here it was the only place with an appointment today um and so we have a 30 minute drive back so hopefully we get good news from this so we can have a good drive back if he's negative and he's feeling better he's probably gonna go to work tomorrow if he's negative and not feeling better he's gonna stay home again if he's positive he has to contact his new job and just, we don't even know what their COVID product protocol is. Um, so we'll just have to figure that out. Anyways, that's what I'm doing now. And hopefully I'm not sitting here for much longer and hopefully we get good news. All right, guys, we got the verdict. Do you want to tell them? <laughs> I got the COVID. <laughs>
He tested positive for COVID. Um, I didn't get tested because I don't really have to be anywhere. But we just picked up his prescriptions. Apparently, they have prescriptions for COVID now. That I don't think was always a thing. But we're going to go grab dinner and then we're going to go home and we're going to do lots of resting. So that's fun. This should be great entertaining content for you guys. How do you feel? We're building a fort. He wants to build a fort. So we're going to build a fort. All right, you guys. It is Friday. It is 9.45 in the morning. And I woke up at about, I don't know, 8 maybe. Um, my boyfriend's still sleeping. Last night was a little bit of a rough night. His fever got up to 102. Um, so I was kind of up for a lot of the night, checking his temperature every hour, making sure he had cold rag on his head and getting ibuprofen to break the fever. But, uh, we didn't spike anywhere above 102, which is good. Um, I still feel fine. I don't think I have it. If he has just the first strain of COVID, I probably won't get it because I've already had that. If he has the Delta variant, I might get it because I haven't had that one. Um, but I feel fine so far um, and I've been sleeping in the same bed as him. I even drank after him before I knew he had it. Um, like before, when his like symptoms first started, we thought it was just a cold. I drank after him and kissed him. Obviously, he's my boyfriend. Um, so I don't know if I'm going to get it. I'm feeling fine um so i don't think i have it yet um so that's good um i don't really feel like doing much because i've been getting really bad sleep because i've been staying up to make sure that he his fever doesn't go too high and um just making sure he's doing okay but um yeah i'm just tired because of that but i feel overall fine um i've had a really bad headache i don't know if that has anything to do with it it could i don't know i'm not gonna go get tested just because i don't go anywhere i don't do anything so i am just gonna stay home for however many days but i was about to um just edit the vlog and i didn't have or i don't have a video going up today for friday just because of everything that's gone down and i just didn't film anything and don't really have any energy to film anything so that's okay i will hopefully um get something in plan it for next friday but i'm about to just edit the vlog now and i wanted to give you guys a quick update for this morning i don't know really what i'll film today i mean we're just sitting here doing nothing um i am going to get some work done i'm going to relist some flip lots um probably relist some just old inventory that's my own um i also have a bunch of stuff i need to list so i'm glad that I have a bunch of stuff that's already ready to list. Um, and then I'm also glad that I have so much inventory to work through since I can't go anywhere and can't do anything. Um, I haven't been applying for flip lots because I've just been not worried about that. I haven't really done too much work because, again, I haven't been worried about that. Um, so um, I'm going to edit this vlog. It won't take very long. It's pretty short. There's not a bunch of stuff going on. Um, and then... I'm going to relist some flip lots and then I'll probably work on listing some stuff um, until he wakes up and then probably make him some food um, and all that. But that is a quick little Friday update. I, like I said, will film um, anything I think is interesting, any updates, keep you guys updated on how he's feeling, how I'm feeling, if I got it, um, all that kind of stuff. So um, that's what we're looking at and I will be back later. <laughs> All right, you guys, it's about 5.30 right now, and look who is sitting up and somewhat mobile. Um, he's had a pretty rough day, kind of um, a little worse than yesterday, we'd say, but he's feeling better now. It's about 5.30, and I've just I been... I smell. Oh, yeah, he can smell and taste oh, right now. He's been taking his antibiotics and ibuprofen every time he has a fever. 
he just broke a fever like an hour ago that he's had all day long um so that is great we're back down to a 90 was it 98 right now he is looking for another movie for us to watch we've already watched three movies three movies so he's looking for another one i am re uh not relisting just listing some stuff with vindu i did a bunch of relisting um edited the vlog this morning did all that i love horton here's a who but that's not scary it, but... <laughs> <laughs> we're actually waiting for my parents to get back they went to dinner since we couldn't go they're gonna bring us something back i'm starving are you starving just hungry not starving i'm starving i haven't eaten like anything all day but we're looking good he's not as bad as he was earlier so we're hoping we have a pretty good night tonight um but we don't know i guess i'll keep you updated um i don't know if i'll come back later tonight maybe i don't know it's only 5 30 so maybe but yeah that's what's going on